speaker. She is the host of our event tonight, Lucy Clay. Uh, Lucy is the founder and the owner of Express Ways to Learning, uh, which is dedicated to uh, helping children who learn differently. I love the way she, she phrases that in her mission statement, who learn differently. She doesn't say with learning disabilities. Um, she's just passionate and dedicated to finding different ways to connect with students at every age and help them overcome what others might consider you know, learning disabilities like dyslexia. She is also the founder, the creator of the Simplicity Project Wellness Initiative, and we know it's the Simplicity Project they are the ones hosting tonight. And it's, it's their mission to raise an awareness and provide education and advocacy for people who are facing end-of-life decisions. This is a topic that's so important she's going to get into, and I'm sure we're going to be hearing a lot more about this in the future. She's on the cutting edge, so she's bringing a very important message to us tonight. Now, if all of that is not enough, Lucy is a skilled artist. She also paints beautiful works of art, like Jack Wilde, you see, uh, throughout the sanctuary. She's authored and published a couple of books, which are available tonight. Uh, you'll find them on Lucy's table. I'm not sure where that is, but we'll paint. Table eight, be sure and find that table. Okay. Uh, also, uh, let's, let me tell you, the books that she's written, Betrothed, I've read that one, I love it. Does anybody else? I mean, it's just it's an awesome book. It's like a movie. I don't know if you it either, and I, I can hardly put it down. It was wonderful. And that was called Betrothed, Committed to Love, Light, and Life. And then she's also written Simplicity, Stories of His Love, and both of those are available tonight. So, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Lucy Clay. Lucy Clay. Death to life. And so 
On table eight, the number of completion just sort of happened. I didn't really plan that, but we have um, what is called a protective medical decisions document. And they are available. And Diane Del Chiaro is holding it back there. If any of you all would like to uh, speak with her about that, it is provides more protection than a living will. Most authorities believe if Jack Weil, who painted these paintings, um, had one, he would still be alive today. So you can think about that. Feel free to ask her questions. Also, we have a gift for each of you all tonight. This is a carry-on care package. It includes gifts of life. And you'll have to peek inside to see what's in there. I'm not going to tell you. Anyway, and um, this is a little bit different than a bucket list. In the, if you get the Simplicity Stories of His Love little book, it talks about the difference between a bucket list and a carry-on. And um, a carry-on, these are a timeless moments that you want to just carry on through eternity. And that's what this is about. So make sure you get one. And again, I just want to thank each of you all for coming tonight. Thank you.